How about alcohol and caffeine? Are they good for anything in our bodies? Alcohol and caffeine. Uh, well, God bless coffee, got me through many uh, a night in the emergency room, uh, but I don't drink it anymore. Uh, I think the, well, there's a difference between caffeine and, and coffee, first of all, and coffee I find is hard on my stomach lining, it stains my teeth, it uh, uh, raises my blood pressure. And it's the coffee oils that make coffee coffee that does a lot of this mischief. Uh, if you, but to, but caffeine, there's no question, it's a pleasant stimulant and seems to be fairly benign, taken in small amounts. And because it's found in green tea, if people like a little caffeine lift in the morning, a cup of green tea I think is fine, and I haven't seen any medical studies show that that really raises your risk for any disease at all. And so a cup, maybe two of, of green tea during the day, if you want some caffeine, that would be the way to get it. Uh, alcohol, I have no use for whatsoever. I, I, it, it kills every tissue in the body. We, we dip our surgical instruments in the hospital into alcohol because it kills everything it touches. And you open up uh, Harrison's textbook of medicine and you'll see alcohol toxicity page after page of every organ, alcohol, cardiomyopathy of the heart, alcohol uh, encephalopathy of the brain, alcohol myopathy of the muscles, alcohol neuropathy of the nerves. It, it destroys every tissue it, uh, it contacts. I don't care what it does to your cholesterol level. Now, the best way to lower your cholesterol is stop eating it. Um, but to uh, people are using the alcohol, oh, doctor says it's good for me, well, it lowers my cholesterol, I'll have another glass of wine, if a little is good, more must be better, and, uh, oh, it's good for you. Did you hear red wine is good if French don't get heart attacks because they drink wine, and, and this is what it's become. Meanwhile, we're seeing damage throughout the body, alcohol, every glass of, of alcohol a woman drinks raises her risk of breast cancer, it raises a guy's risk of prostate cancer, it ages your tissues, it injures your liver, it, it destroys brain cells. There's nothing beneficial in drinking alcohol as far as I can see. And there's non-alcoholic wines. Uh, if you're at the party and you're holding a glass, it's nobody's business what's in that glass. And if you want to make it seltzer water or, or grape juice, well, that's just fine as far as I'm concerned. But uh, I, I have a real antipathy against alcohol. I think it brings out the worst in human beings and it, it really damages every tissue in the body. So you won't find me at, at your local wine bar sampling the, the <laughs> turns there.